Hi guys, welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the beta channel on version 23H2. In this video, we're talking about the build 22635.5015. As I've said, for version 23H2, this is a small build that has a few interesting improvements that we're going to cover in this video. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the Tech Based channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, the beta channel, Microsoft is official introducing the new emoji icon in the system tray and as you can see you can add emojis gifs symbols and more you can select the windows logo plus period to open the emoji and more panel of course you can always click on it to open it and you also have at the top the shortcut that you need to press in order to open it also if you go in right click on the taskbar and then go to taskbar settings you're going to have additional options next to system tray icons you're going to have the emoji and more panel you can select to always have it on the system tray only while typing or never basically if you have it on only while typing if we open notepad for example you're going to notice that it'll be opened up so we can type here we can open this emoji panel and we can insert an emoji also in the settings app if we go to the system and then scroll down below to about microsoft will soon enough insert here a new frequently asked questions section this section doesn't have any questions yet listed but in the near future it will have them in this update there's also a nice new feature added to snipping tool of course you can open out the microsoft store go to downloads and then click on get update get all the latest updates for all your Microsoft Store apps and then after you open snipping tool and select the recording function click on new select a location and then let's start recording a quick video here once you stop the recording we're gonna notice that this recording will be opened up in snipping tool and we also have this new option which is trim video trim and we can use this to trim parts of our video really quickly basically a quick little editor that you can use to cut out the parts that you don't want or don't like from a recording that you've done with snipping then you can click on apply and the final result will be basically the recording that you've edited. So I think this is a great new feature added to snipping tool and uh, Microsoft is really doing a good job here. We also have a few fixes in this build, for example, related to the file explorer, Microsoft will add text scaling support in various wording and error message dialogues for text scaling. And also they fixed an issue which was causing file explorer home to crash for some insiders in the previous flight. Also related to windowing, Microsoft fixed an issue where the snap bar at the top of the screen was unexpectedly showing corners on the side closest to the screen so that should now be fixed related to settings inside system and then about Microsoft fix an issue where the storage count in settings wasn't correct in some cases and we also have another fix fix an issue for insiders using the ability to resume OneDrive files which could result in your mouse frequently showing a spinning icon there are also a few known issues in this build but they are not new so they have been documented before if you want to check out more info about this of course you can always check out the article below or the official Microsoft blog post so this is basically the build for the better channel if you enjoyed this video Video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was your man at home, TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.